it's about eight o'clock in the evening and obviously it's dark outside so we've got the lighting on here in our spare room, our incubating room. Now we were hoping that our quails, our quail eggs would hatch yesterday and we seem to have got the timing one day out because this morning I checked the quails, no sign of any hatching, one o'clock. This afternoon I checked, still no sign of any hatching. Had to go out for a meeting at that point, got back at 3.30 and we already by then had six of these little guys had hatched and we've got lots more in there that have hatched as well. Now we've got 24 eggs in there. You can still see that a few of them haven't hatched but we think that the majority of them in here have now hatched so first thing tomorrow morning these are going to be transferred into a bigger uh, quail box where our older quails are in fact there they are in there so the older quails will be moved into the chick brooder box that we've got in here and then the baby quails will be moved into there for a few weeks but it definitely looks now that our plans for quails were really taking off. It's now 24 hours since the quail eggs started to hatch and I'm pleased to say that of the 24 eggs, 22 have hatched. Now most of them hatched yesterday. We had a few overnight and we've had two more today. Still very shaky on their feet and still not quite dried out. Now we need this incubator tonight to uh, for, for some duck eggs that we've got. So the two remaining eggs which are probably infertile uh, we're going to crack open later on and just check them and uh, if there's a chick in there then we'll, we'll take it out. But all the chicks other than those two have now been moved to this brooder box that we've got and we've got the heater in there and they've got food and water as well. So here they all are. Nice little tiger markings to them. But uh, they're all looking quite happy and chirpy. Uh, but we have been absolutely delighted with the uh, the rate at which they've hatched. Uh, so 90% hatch rate. So what we've got to do now is build an aviary for these little, little fellas.